Now, Karibishta Sana, you can take your seats. Praise God. Let's go to the book of 1 Peter, chapter 5, verse 7. And it says, Give all your worries and cares to God, for He cares about you. Praise God. Buona Sifire. It says, Give all your worries and cares to God, for He cares about you. Kumba Mungu anasema, Tumpatie mahangaiko yetu yote. Tumpatie mawazo yetu yote. Yale mambo ambayo yanatuangaisha. Kwa sababu anatujali. Buwana asifiwe. God is a father. God is a father. And there is no father that is seated here. Even in the natural. Who does not care about their children. Ata kama ni wabaya na mnagani. Ata kama we have called ni majambazi. Ata kama ni walevi. Even if they're in drug addiction. Every father cares about their children. Every parent cares about their children. Buwana asifiwe. I, I, you know, tunaona sa zingine muizi ya meshikwa. If muizi ya meshikwa na ni wakutoka mahali ambapo mnaishi. And the parent is told, especially mothers, wameambiwa tutotoko wa meshikwa, anataka kuchomo. Unapata mama analia na sema tafadhali. Tafadhali, spare their life. Afadhali hata kaya gerezani, lakini ya endele kuwa hai. Musimu uwe tafadhali. Even if, if it is death that is a must, let me die on behalf of my child. That is the care of, if us, the Bible says, as parents, natural parents, who, are, who, are, who have many weaknesses, who have many sins that we, we struggle every day by the grace of God to overcome, give our kids the best, give our children the best, and want the very best for our children. What about God? What about God? Mungu huyu ambaye atumi macho ya watu kukuona. Mungu huyu ambaye atumi opinion ya watu you know, when we want to choose leaders or when, when, you know, we look at people's opinion. What to anasema nini? Weni mtu wa inagani? Weni mtu wa kuaminika? Weni mtu unaweza? And everyone gives an opinion based on what they want or what they imagine about you. But God does not consider that. When God has said, I am doing this over your life, he does it. Na ndiyo mana tuko hapa leo. Kumba mungu alisema, watoto wangu wameangaishwa na magonjwa. Watoto wangu wameangaishwa na mambo mengi. Nataka kuwa I care about them. The tears of his children reach him. Buwana asifiwe. Buwana asifiwe. Kila mmoja mbae ya mekuja hapa. Akiamini kwamba huyu mungu baba yetu. Ana kushugulikia. Hilo linatendeka leo hii kwa jina la Yesu Kristo. Hallelujah. Hilo linatendeka. I was looking at the way watu wameleto kwa wheelchairs. People have come with crutches. And I'm, I'm just saying, oh God. These people know that you're going to do it. They have come because they believe. Na ninajua kuamba mungu huyo atatenda. Hiyo addiction ime kusumbua mungu huyo atashugulikia. We are praying for this county. That there will be life. A new life. A new life. Tunakata kifo. Tunakata maangaiko ya kuwawa. Tunakata kidnap. Tunakata rape. And God is going to do that today. Bwana asifiwe. He cares about us. God cares. God cares. Kumba you have been raped and you have been damaged. God cares that your loved one has been killed. Na maisha yae wamechukuliwa prematurely. God cares. God cares that our sons and daughters are committing suicide because things are so difficult. God cares and he wants to take care of that. And I know there is healing. Healing for our bodies. Healing for our spirit. Healing for our minds. And healing for this nation. Healing for this county in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Kwamba mambo ya tafunguka. Mambo ya tabadilika. Praise God. Hallelujah. And it says... The Bible says in Hebrews 10, 23, it says, God can be trusted to keep his promises. As a believer, tunamini kile mungu wa mesema. Uo uponyaji mekuja kutafuta, si kwa sababu tulitangaza, ni kwa sababu umesoma kwa neno, linasema kwamba, nitawaponya, nitayaondoa magonjwa yenu yote. Na mtaishi maisha yenu yote. And you have believed that word. And this word is able to turn into flesh. It is able to manifest. Hilo neno mungu amesema, linatendeka. Shuhuda mtasikia, watu walikuja hapa hawatembei, saizi wanatembea. Watu walikuja hapa walikuwa tasa, wanaito mama ya watoto. Bwana asifiwe. And the same thing God is going to do today. Kila county liyo wakilishu hapa. Najua counties nyingi zimekuja, Bungoma imefika, Migori imefika, Homabe imefika, Kisumu imefika, Nairobi imefika. I know there's a representative here from all the 47 counties of this nation. And they have come.
trusting God that he will do. And as you have come, as we are receiving healing, that healing is going everywhere because God is not contained in this tent. Mungu hatujamfungia hapa kwa hii tent. God is able to move. His power is able to move every part of this nation and there will be healing. And I am telling you and I am very sure as I know my name that God is going to do everything. This country is going to have a new history in the mighty name of Jesus. This country is going to have a new testimony in the mighty name of Jesus. And those who are here watch Kisi County. Watch Kisi County. Watch Kisi County. Things are going to turn around. Things are going to turn around. And you'll hear good reports in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Nataka ni waombe msimame tena. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. If there is someone in this place, this grounds, God says he's going to do extraordinary miracles. Kila mmoja amejileta hapa peke yake. Kila mmoja amekuja hapa kwa sababu laitaji ya moyo wake. Kila mmoja ameletwa hapa kwa sababu akwa na msukumo ambao anataka mzigo huo utolewe. And this God right now is asking that we give him our cares. Hilo jambo limekuleta hapa kama ni ugonjwa. Mwambie Mungu ninakuachia. Just raise your voice. Don't be afraid. Hapa kwa nyumba ya Bwana ni nyumba ya maombi. Just pray. Just jirani yako ajui kama ni mgongo inakuma ama ni kichwa ama ni mke amekutesa ama ni mume amekungoa meno ama ni watoto wako wamekufa ama ni watoto unataka or you, li- you are looking for a job wachawi wamekuangaisha. Just raise your voice. Mwambie Bwana nimekuja. Bwana nimekuja unishughulikie. Huu ugonjwa taja kwa jina. Kama ni typhoid, kama ni ulcers, kama ni diabetes, kama ni HIV, kama ni cancer Taja sasa hivi let the lord start working on your case right now in the mighty name of jesus christ father we bless your name we honor you we stand in your presence this hour we are standing here on our behalf on behalf of the families that are represented here on behalf of our county kisi and every other county that needs your light on behalf of this nation my father and as we stand here on behalf of many other nations that are represented here bwana shughulikia kila mmoja wetu roho mtakatifu nakualika tembea katikati ya watoto wako anza kuwaponya katika jina la yesu as they are call upon your name as they call upon your name for healing as they call upon your name for deliverance as they call upon your name for salvation of god minister to each one of them minister to each one of them you care about us oh god and we surrender everything to you mizigo tumebeba i know there's somebody here who's struggling with depression unaona kwamba maisha hayana maana the lord is setting you free in the mighty name of jesus christ the lord is setting you free today that your mind will be clear once again that there will be healing in your spirit there will be healing in your mind healing in your body and those doors will open wengine mumelaaniwa mumeambiwa hamtaoa hamtaolewa hamtapata watoto hamtapata wachumba hamtapita shuleni you will not amount to anything the lord said jesus christ became a curse so that we be blessed the blessing of the lord is upon you call upon the blessing of the lord bwana amesema ametubariki kila mmoja na kile amekusudia lazima litendeke because he has good plans for us We thank you my father. Thank you for the healing that you're already doing my God. Thank you for the deliverance. Is there many of us are even laying our plans before you today oh God. You say men make plans but it is you who accomplishes them. It is you who makes the ones that are desired to be done according to your will oh God. We pray that every plan that anyone here has raised to you even our leaders oh God that those plans will be according to your will. We thank you mighty father because you cannot be throned you remain to be God in Jesus mighty name In Jesus mighty name Father we thank you We thank you for your presence We thank you for this far and we thank you oh God that everyone that was coming to this meeting has come safely and they are here to receive from you Father I pray as you told us that to come and see what you're going to do 
we thank you because you have already seen it starting to happen. Thank you for every deliverance because I know you will do it. Thank you for every healing because I know you will do it. Thank you for every salvation that our sons and daughters are being set free already in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. That you, O oh Lord, will be exalted above every other person that is in this sanctuary today. We thank you, O oh Lord, for everything you'll do. At the end of the day, we'll bless your name, we'll praise you, and we'll exalt you because Buana Utako to tenda wema. Asante Jehovah inuliwa milele ni katika jina la Yesu Kristo tumeomba na kuamini kila mmoja aseme amen amen hallelujah 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 bwana anazidi kuwatenda mema amen hallelujah